It's been a year since the May 20th, 2013 tornado outbreak. Tornadoes, damaging winds, and hail hit the middle of the country hard. More than 30 tornadoes touched down, but most remember the day because of one. That's the EF5 that began in Newcastle, Oklahoma, and traveled east-northeast through Moore. The Storm Prediction Center that morning issued a moderate risk for severe weather with a particular emphasis on tornadoes. A surface low coupled with a strong upper level trough was headed for central Oklahoma. By the afternoon, daytime heating had done its job and storms were firing. At 2.40 in the afternoon, the National Weather Service has issued a tornado warning. The National Weather Service issued its first warning for Newcastle and more. A little before three, a tornado was spotted and the warning was extended. In all, the storm was on the ground for 40 minutes, traveling 14 miles. At its widest, the tornado was more than a mile wide. Total damage done was roughly $2 billion, the most expensive tornado in Oklahoma's history. More than 200 people were injured and 24 died from this single tornado, the ninth deadliest in the state's history. An amazing fact considering it destroyed so much of the community, including more than 1,000 homes and an elementary school. For Storm Shield, I'm meteorologist Jason Myers.